California's snowpack is more than two and a half times larger than average this year. And as the weather gets warmer, it's going to melt. As ABC 10 News reporter Moses Small discovered, this could be good news and bad. California's Department of Water Resources says the state's snowpack broke records this year. Geologist Dr. Pat Abbott says there's no question we needed the snow. The melting of snow has always been important every single year in California. This comes as the latest U.S. drought monitor update shows almost two-thirds of the state is drought-free, a huge improvement over the past few months. Unfortunately, the snowpack can't guarantee will stay that way. Drought is part of California. We've had a temporary respite. That doesn't mean it has come and gone. It will be back sooner than we would like. The snow can be a valuable shield against wildfires, but only if it melts slowly. Plants stay healthy longer. They're more hydrated. It's harder for them to catch on fire. If we have a massive heat wave, say here in early June, and all that snow is melted and gone, the plants don't get more water. They start drying out. By the time we get to the end of the summer, it's easier for them to ignite. The bigger the fire are, and the greater challenge there is for our firefighters. A quick melt can also overwhelm places near the Sierra Nevada that got more rain than they can handle this winter. Places like Tulare Lake, it was dry for years up until this past winter, and now it's more than 100 square miles in size, flooding communities around it, and the area is expecting even more flooding once that snowpack melts. But Dr. Abbott says it's a necessary risk for water the state has needed for years. The snow we've gotten this winter, absolute positive. On the other side, of course, nothing is ever 100%, right? Moses Small, ABC 10 News. San Diego County gets most of its water from the Colorado River, which remains near historic lows.